Hi everyone, my name is Bianca Henry. I attend Good Shepherd and I just wanna say that I'm super excited to share my testimony. I'm a part of the worship team and well, let me just start by saying that my family is doing really well. Everyone is very healthy and happy and my mom is probably currently at home feeding my dog, Turkey, so when I say each and every one of my family members are doing well, I mean <laughs> everyone. But yeah, so if I try to explain how Jesus has brought hope into my life, I would just say by his love. I know that could be another topic. Love is a whole other topic that we could go through, but when I think about my relationship with Jesus, I think about how he protects me and how he is my, my rock. He is the one who loves me unconditionally. And when I can trust in him, that means that I can give my life to him and trust in the plans that he has for my future and for my life. So I just, I'm just, I'm just in awe when I think about it because Jesus' love gives me hope. And when I think about it, I think I find a lot of the fruits of the Spirit when I just spend my time with Jesus. So I don't know if anyone's been having a hard time like connecting through these videos because, you know, you're not in person. It's really hard to connect when you're not there when you're not presently somewhere like listening like and connecting emotionally and mentally like for me I know it's hard but I just want to say that Jesus can meet you where you're at so every time I meet with Jesus it's in my secret place when I'm praying when I'm worshiping that's when I feel his love the most so I just really wanted to share the scripture and the scripture is Psalm 18, 1 through 6. And it says, I love you, Lord. You are my strength. The Lord is my rock, my fortress, and my savior. My God is my rock to whom I found protection. He is my shield, the power that saves me, and my place of safety. I called on the Lord who is worthy of praise, and he saved me from my enemies. The rope of death entangled me. Floods of destruction swept over me. The grave wrapped its rope around me. Death laid a trap in my path. But in my distress, I cried out to the Lord. Yes, I prayed to my God for help. He heard me from his sanctuary. My cry to him reaches his ears. So I'm just going to share this song with you. And if you need to reach out to the Lord and just feel his love and feel his presence, just want to encourage you to do that.
this morning, Lord, and I, I just pray that you would reach to them right now and that they would feel your presence and know that you care for them and you love them and that you are always watching over them and that you have a specific plan for each and everyone listening right now. And I just pray a blessing over their life that you would restore them as they're listening and just give them a new hope. In your name I pray. Amen.